you know, like uh, it is uh, <laughs> maybe it is paranoia. I think it's uh, like it's uh, it's quite sensible. Yeah. <laughs> Nothing much you can do about it, there, though. Yeah. But do you kind of feel uh, passionately about um, the state of things as they are, you know, the state of the nation, the state of the world, the fact that America are doing this, the fact that Britain are doing that? I, just, I don't really feel passionately about it. I feel um, it's... Um, I just see mistakes in every, every action that goes on, so I sort of like uh, find it overwhelming because I disagree so fundamentally with the way we live and what we do yeah. that, you know, I'm not sort of, and I figure that that might be normal or natural to feel like that. To if disagree you're with... Do you know what I mean? Then I sort of like think, well, I'm not going to really sort of like uh, make myself, I don't want to feel so uncomfortable all the time. You know, like, that, like locally, they've, so I saw a thing and they said that they don't like these kids blowing up, they've blown up a couple of cars and blown up a couple of... Um, several, about seven or eight uh, phone booths around here. Blown them up? Yeah, with uh, large fireworks. Oh. And they're blowing up cars as well with them. Oh, right. That's what I do around here. Yeah. And, um, For fun, mate. Right? Yeah, and they sort of, like, they've worked out that they're going to have a meeting about that and sort of, like, try and uh, uh, stop that going on, to get legislation. Yeah. I think, you know, I think, well, because when I, back to Blue Peter, I remember that you're meant to put your pets in on Guy Fawkes night and then you have the fireworks, you see, and I think, well, around here there are a lot of fireworks, sort of like from uh, October to February, yeah. you know, really big ones, and blowing stuff up a lot, yeah. and I sort of like find it, sort of like, don't bother me too much, because I don't, I'm scared of the bangs, yeah. but I think, well, that's <coughs> probably not very good, and I also sort of think, well, I don't understand how the people have managed to find it interesting to do. But I sort of think, well, they're, they're, they're trying to mess stuff up, so it's probably a good idea to not have that happening. Yeah. But, you know, that's the only one thing I've heard that they want to do that makes any sense at all. The rest of the time, they're harassing prostitutes. The they're, council yeah, people. Yeah, they're harassing prostitutes. They're building on good space, like what they call wasteland, which is, yeah. Yeah, I've, and I'm a, I think wasteland should be preserved over a bloody green belt. Mm. And, uh, <laughs> you know, they're, pu they're putting in huge sections of road yeah. where we don't need sections of road. They're trying to, they're building, they're building worse sort of like office blocks and flats and things. And yeah. no one's sort of like got a problem with that. Yeah. They don't sort of like, uh, they're still doing out of town shopping places. Yeah. You know, they've, they've got identikit shops all the way down. I should some in the same boutique rubbish, mm. you know, in each shop. So I sort of like think, well, that's, that's a lot, it's a lot overwhelming. You know, they haven't worked out that cars aren't a great idea. Yeah. They've not really worked out that bicycles are genius. Uh. They haven't worked out that uh, they need to, um, that we need a good, good train system. Uh. And tr trams and all these things that make society a little bit more digestible. <coughs> all, the, all the positive aspects of what the Victorians got right. Mm. And they got rid of a lot of the positive things that the Victorians got right, and yeah. kept a lot of the negatives that the Victorians got wrong, yeah. and um, and it, it exported a lot of them to the rest of the world. Yeah. And uh, meanwhile, uh, the whole the whole thing is sort of like highly uncomfortable for me. Yeah. So I sort of I think well, I'd best not be involved in that. In opposition, I mean, you, you don't feel. I mean, you feel in opposition, but you don't feel as though you want to. Um, but you don't feel as though you want to... I'm well, you're talking about feeling not uncomfortable. Well, I'm is a bit too conservative for your... Um, you see, my thing is that I'm sort of like... I'm a bit too conservative for the... Uh, uh, you see, I believe in sort of like... Uh, commu you know, like in uh, having... In, in decentralisation. Yeah. And uh, policemen on the beat. Yeah. You see, I've got, I'm far too conservative to get in bed with these left-wing people and all these... Uh, uh, you know, I just sort of like, all I look at is if something seems to make sense. I sort of think, well, if yeah. they had closed circuit television put up when, uh, in the 80s, mm. there had been a public outcry and they'd have said it's 1984, we're not allowed to have it. Now mm. they've signed up saying it's okay, we've put up CCTV. Mm. And, you, and, and you see, I don't think it's any use to anyone seeing their husband being, watching their husband being kicked to death on some, uh, on some useless television programme. Yeah. The best idea would be have, 
uh, uh, have policemen there to stop it. Uh, uh, and I mean, I don't, you know, like, so and I mean, and I mean, so like people, you know, so like. So you're interested in direct, in, in kind of direct local concerns. This would be, this would be your, the level well, that you look everything at politics. Has to, well, everything has to be brought. Everything has to devolve. Yeah. And that happens in art and everything. Everything needs to come close to the ground and be what it's about, not right. what people pretend it's about. Right. But that means that people have to stop um, thinking that more televisions and more cars and more te television stations is going to save us, or being on the internet is going to yeah. save you, yeah. or having yeah. a mobile phone is going to be of any use. Yeah. All these things are phony, and they have to be sort of like stripped back, and yeah. no one will want to do it. So they've yeah. all got to have a war until they want to work yeah. out yeah. what what they what they actually think is important in life yeah. and i've i've and the, the only way it's going to happen is if they if they do go and have their war so they've all got you know we i mean i, I don't think they feel that involved but i'll, I'll, I'll concede that i'm here as well <laughs> you know, we've got yeah. we've got we've got a, we've got a bit go to a very pain, painful place yeah it doesn't matter what i say about it or what anyone else says about it because the only way that it can change is if people change what they want or what yeah. they expect yeah and, and that is that means going a long long further down the road to what i consider a very unappealing world that i have no interest in all right okay <laughs> um do you, is that kind of sense of disgust almost um, at the root. I mean a lot of your stuff is kind of retro. I don't think it's a, I don't have a disgust I don't think. Maybe there is disgust in it. All it is is it's, like, it's, it's more kind of a bit disappointed should we say. Disappointed is very different from disgust. Yeah alright. You know it's not like I've, I've suddenly kind of been eating a dog shit. Yeah. It's just that, like um, it's just like it's not very appealing. No. Uh, but as far as um, I have no interest in retro, I'm only interested in the new and the modern. And what I'm saying is, is what the new and the modern needs to be. Retro suggests sort of like um, uh, digging up something because of its uh, uh, quaint, it, it, it reminds us of a, <coughs> a quaint period or yeah, whatever. Yeah. Whereas um, my, what I'm talking about is if something works or not. Yeah. So I'm talking about things that work. So, like, you wouldn't have, you know, you'd have, um, if you, uh, if you're driving along the road and you take a wrong turn and then you go back and get back on the main road. Uh -huh. There's, no, no one says, oh, right, you made the route, you're, uh, uh -huh. you know, you, you don't sort of, like, just, uh -huh. or if you, you know, you think you're, you think that you've, uh, boxed yourself in and buggered, then you sort of like retract yourself from it and go and use something that works. Yeah. I mean, a bike, you're saying I think bicycles are brilliant, it's not retro. Bicycles are brilliant because they are brilliant. Yeah. They're a work of genius. They don't, and <coughs> someone can invent something new that isn't a bicycle, mm. or someone can invent using a cup upside down. Yeah. It does it uh, because that would be new and original. Mm. But it doesn't actually work. Yeah, no, I mean, that's very so, sensible and uh, so I applaud that. So what I mean is it's like, it's like, it would be nothing to do, my idea of people having bicycles, or the use of the bicycle. Like that, on my train, they don't want bicycles on the train coming south east. Yeah. Rather, now you see, like I would suggest that they give a forty pound, dis forty percent discount to anyone using a bicycle yeah. into London, and that London sorts that out. And as it is a pr as a directive, yeah. now that would be in keeping with what they want to happen, and would be forward thinking and modern. Yeah. Now someone can say that it's sort of like it, it's trying to be cool, cute yeah. or retro, but it's actually you know the things like we had an electric integrated tram system uh, 50 years ago yeah. and I'm um, saying that we should have one now is not being cute and retro yeah. it would be having an uh, integrated electric tra tram system in Britain now yeah. would be uh, the height of, mo of, <coughs> of, of the modern right. so I mean like it's not it's like what works yeah so it's kind of nostalgia for an age yet to come I don't think something you don't know, it's huge, I wouldn't say that so it's just what works? Yeah. I mean, I'm looking at something I'm and thinking, like, is it any good? Yeah. I mean, is it any good that uh, you get a load of kids making disco shoes for people yeah. without piss breaks in the third world, yeah. and that you don't and you don't make stuff in your own country, and uh, like, and people don't aren't interested in craft stuff? Like, I make books. Yeah. You can't get decent paper because all the people who make books at small scale in England want to yeah. do them cheaper. Yeah. So they'll save ten p, which means all the people who used to like small 
uh, companies that used to make decent yeah. paper yeah. can't afford to make it anymore, so they don't make it because people want to say, people want disposable books yeah, at a really yeah. cheap rate. Yeah, now, which I is by people like India. And I don't think that sort of like um, I don't think that. I mean, it might be the height of being modern, but I think it don't work. No, but I mean that, that's 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 what we were talking about—the whole kind of globalisation against well, they work that, it, yeah, against yeah, that yeah, no, sort of strain, against that current. Yeah, you know, so it's all sort of like just simple. There's no sort of um, doesn't need a, a uh, fancy name. Just you know, as an ideology, it's just sort of like working out how to get to a from A to B. Yeah, sort of like pragmatic. So you'd say that you're a simple man, a simple artisan. No. Ah. Mm-hmm. Okay. I I just say I'm just a person who does a bit of painting and writing. Uh, you know, I don't think people are what they, you know, I don't, I'm just an amateur. Yeah, this, this kind of whole idea of amateur is something that you've embraced to your heart, isn't it? I mean, do you think you're always going to embrace that idea of... Uh, well, it's about the light touch. The light touch or the right touch? Light. Oh, OK. It's touching the world lightly. It's not making a big deal out of something that isn't a big deal, namely art and yeah. doing a painting. Yeah. And making a record. Everyone makes a big deal out of it and that's why they want such huge pay rises and mentions in the countryside. Yeah. But it is a big deal. I mean, creativity is, is the thing. I mean, this I is what... made it into a big deal. It belongs to everyone and it's a natural state of being human. It's yeah, just that people but it get into watching television too much. Well, exactly. I mean, it is, it is a natural state, but people don't bother. And I mean, yeah. this is the, the kind of importance of, of you and people like you because, I mean, you kind of actually do things. So if people see that you're doing things, they might kind of think, oh, well, you know, that could be a great idea. That's know, it. To, yeah, that, to do that, things. Yeah, that's when it works. That's the idea, yeah. Yeah. So it is sort of like it should be... People sort of like think I could do that. That's handy. Yeah. Yeah. You're quite a philosophical person, aren't you? Yeah. Do you... Uh, any particular philosophies you subscribe to, or is it a uh, um, homemade uh, affair? Well, I don't know if it... Uh, well, what, 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 I would be... Um, I don't know. It's... Uh, uh, do Christian and um, Buddhist, uh, Buddhist views count as philosoph- philosophical? Yeah. Well, that kind of good. Zen approach, everything... I don't know much about Zen. Like, I've not read anything much about that, but I know no. a bit about Christianity and Buddhist, Buddhism. Oh, right. What is it about Buddhism that, uh, that appeals to you? Sensible and pragmatic, and tries to take, tries to uh, accentuate, tries to, tries to get people to accentuate their finer qualities right. rather than their work negative qualities. Right. Well, I mean, it, it only, but not by sort of like, um, not by denial, but by observation. By observation well, itself. you see what works. Yeah. And learn from that. Yeah. That's a difficult thing, isn't it? Actually, kind of learning from. Yeah, but that's better. Than, that's better than a view. It's like the thing is you can yeah, but that's uh, I don't know, I think it's well, it's difficult, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I know I'm not saying it's bad, but I mean, <laughs> it's it is, yeah. Life is 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 is, is but then, you know, it's not a big it's also important to realise not a big deal. Do you want a potato, Julie? Do you want a pota- potato, Julie? Good. I read somewhere in an interview that you talked about the idea of, uh, of failure as in art as being somewhere that uh, that you could meet yourself. Well, we watched. Um, oh, yeah. I was thinking about this yesterday. Oh, yeah. uh, Julie was because Julie was watching. Um, uh, we got DVD. We haven't got. We got. We can watch DVD on the computer. Oh yeah. She got this DVD. Do you want to check one? Yeah, that we do post on the shop. Do you want to do that? Yeah, that. Okay. Um, she was like...